Right guys, we're at the Brewers Fair in the Arneson Centre in Durham. We're here for Sunday lunch but we're just going to show you some of the menus. There's Shell. Available all day. Valentine's three course on That's the Valentine's menu. And then we'll look at the pub grub menu, proper pub grub. There's your favourite show, smothered chicken. Hi, oh, yeah, you're all right. Looks nice. What are we doing? <laughs> I'm just doing a little video of the food. Oh, should look nice. I'll put her straight in a minute. I've never been so stressed nice. in my life. Trying to get carrot in there. <laughs> Parsnips. Cauliflower cheese. Nice selection. Yeah, very well. What can I get for you, sweetheart? A bit of each, yeah? Do you have any plans for this evening, darling? Uh -huh. 
Have you got any plans for this evening? Oh, I'm probably walking home. <laughs> walking home? Yeah. In this cold? Yeah, we love walking. I like walking, just not in the cold. Oh, we don't mind. <laughs> I'm southern, so once it's below double digits, I am out. I am done, me. I don't mind the walk, but like I said, I'm southern, so once it gets cold, I'm like, nah, not doing it. Where you from? Brighton. Oh, yeah, I'm from Brighton. Oh, I? What part? Peacehaven. Oh, Peacehaven. I've had a lady that's just moved up from Pete's season up here. Yeah. 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 Yeah
together now but beef. Damn it. Very underneath me is turkey. Parsnips. We've got potato gratin. Mashed potato, roast potato which is in here somewhere. Cauliflower cheese. Stuck in the water. Uh, Sweden carrot and mash or what's left of it. It's quite delicious. Peas. A pig and blanket here. You can see everything's with the cream and everything in the gravy, everything's kind of blended in together. It's made for me on top. Hand on hand, that's what I say. Right, we're working our way through the food. That's how much I'm starting to stick like, but I need a bit more. That's Shell's progress plate. Nice. Nice, it is nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nice and salty, look at that. Salty, but it's not over salty if that makes sense. Oh, no, it's good on the plate, ain't it? 
what they normally eat. Hmm? What they normally eat. I couldn't eat all mine. I left my fun. It's good effort though, considering how much food is on the trip. You enjoy it. But we'll come back to you in a few minutes with our thoughts on it, our opinions and our scores. Right, so that's Brewers Fair just behind us there. We've just had a Sunday carvery. Um, ten pound, ten pound forty nine for the standard one. Or you can pay an extra pound and get all three meats, and you get a pigs and blanket as well. Um, overall, the meal was good. Uh, there are, I wouldn't say negatives, but there's a couple of, a couple of points where they can improve. Uh, we've just been chatting to one of the chefs off camera. And uh, I would say the meats, the meats were nice. Cameron was a little bit salty, but personally that's not a problem to me. Uh, the veg selection was a bit of a... Um, it, it missed carrots. I was wanting carrots on the plate. I mean, they do, they do the carrots mixed in with the swede as a mash. Uh, which was nice, don't get us wrong. It was nice. I mean, it was nice, but um, I think carrots, it would be nice to see carrots in it. it is a, it's a family friendly. You get a lot of kids in there. I think kids like to see carrots on the plate as well. Uh, a bit too much cream on that dinner as well. I mean, they had cauliflower cheese, which is fine. Got no issue with that. But there was also a potato gratin, which to me didn't belong there. Too much cream. Um, what else was there? Peas, roast potatoes, parsnips. Uh, the mashed potatoes. Stuffing ball. The, the veg, the veg selection was a bit, a bit. Yeah. I mean, we were talking, to, we were talking to this, one of the chefs and. She said that they were supposed to have Savoy cabbage on today, but they had issues with the deliveries. They were supposed to have carrots on as well. And again, they've had issues with the deliveries. And uh, we'll just move back away from the road, get another road knife. Um, Price-wise, because like I say, when we score them, we look at the meal itself, how good it was, selection of veg, the service, and... Um, and uh, what the meat choices were. The meat choices were gammon, turkey and beef. Like I say, we paid the extra pound and went for the trio of meats. And uh, would we be back again? Yeah, definitely. I think it's a, it's a nice place. The staff were nice and friendly. We got, uh, we got permission to fill them in there as well. We're perfectly happy to do that. So, so based on everything we've just said, like I say, the veg selection, the price, uh, the meats, the service, everything rolled into one, what's your score, Shell? A nine. Yeah? A nine. A nine? Yeah. I think it's even from a ten. I'll go for a... I'll go for an eight. I think an eight's a fair score. Like I say, I think if they'd had, if they'd had carrots on, it's about colour as well, you know what I mean? Especially like with kids in there as well. Kids like to see colours, don't they? The carrots and things like that. Um, so there you go, Brewers Fair, Dunelm Ridge, which is at Pity Me. If you don't know where Pity Me is, it's just next to where the 
where we're just next to the Arneson Centre. It's a bit of a shopping complex area just outside of Durham City. And uh, that's where you can find this place. So there you go, that's our scores. And uh, we will be visiting other places in the local northeast area to do um, Sunday lunch reviews. So there you go, guys. That's your lot. I hope you enjoyed the video. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're not already. It's totally free, it doesn't cost a penny. Drop a comment if you have any questions. Share the video. And we will see you on the next one. Wherever that may be. Shell, give us a wave. Bye guys, take care of yourselves.